If you're trying to collect information or meaningful data, Google Forms is the way to go. From quizzes to surveys, it's able to be used for dozens of handy purposes. As part of Google's Drive suite of apps, Forms lets you collect data quickly and efficiently, with a number of options for controlling how you gather information. Confirmation emails are a great addition to any form, sending your respondent a follow-up email that also adds a personal touch to your surveys. Whether you already have an existing Google Form or you're starting from scratch, the first step is to make sure to include a mandatory field where people can enter their email addresses. Without gathering email addresses, you won't be able to send confirmation emails. After you've enabled email addresses in your form's settings, you're ready to enable confirmation emails. To do it, we'll need to install Google's very own form notifications add-on. You can get this by clicking the triple dotted menu icon in the top right corner of your screen, selecting add-ons, then selecting form notifications at the top of the list. Then open Google Forms and click Add-ons to open the Add-ons menu. Select Email Notifications for Google Forms, then click Open. A new window will appear in the bottom right corner of your screen, allowing you to configure notifications. By default, Notify on Form Responses and Thank You Email is turned off. Toggle the option for Thank You Email on and select Automatically under Collect Email. You can then customize the email subject and body by typing a message into the notification email subject in notification email body. Once done, click Save Configuration. The Form Notifications add-on can also send you notifications when your Google Form receives responses. To enable this feature, open the email notifications for Google Forms again. Toggle Notify on Form Responses on and enter your email address in the Enter Recipient Emails text field. Keep in mind that you can add more than one email address here, a useful feature if you're working with a group. You can also choose whether to receive notifications after a specific amount of responses. As an example, we'll enter one to receive a notification email every time somebody fills out the form. Finally, click Save Configuration. If you find Google's own add-ons configuration options to be too limiting, the good news is that there are other add-ons you can use instead. Just browse through the add-on selection and choose one that better meets your needs. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Forms and other technology. And do not forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.